Hey guys, Christina Nichols for ID8 TV, and today we are at the LA Convention Center for the Yoga Expo. Keep watching as we talk to various exhibitors and learn a little bit about the yoga world. Kyle, thanks for talking to us today. Oh, thanks for having me. Thanks for coming. Yes, the expo has been great. It's a really good turnout. It's nice, warm energy. Um, what inspired you to create this event? I wanted to create an opportunity for the LA yoga community to come together and uh, at the same time showcase local products and services that are relevant to this demographic. How did you get involved in the yoga world? Um, about two years ago I got my yoga certification mm -hmm. and uh, there's so many teachers I wanted to practice with and uh, it was just difficult to travel to all the different studios so I said hey you know what if we can get all the studios uh, and teachers and participants together and so that's what we do at the Yoga Expo. But your next one is going to be in Pasadena. Yeah, in 2018, uh, we're contracting Pasadena. Nice. And how, what do you see foresee for the growth of the Yoga Expo? So last year, we produced 11 uh, Yoga Expos all across North America. Um, in 2017 and 18, we're focusing on our primary markets, which are Fort Lauderdale, Los Angeles, and Houston. Nice. And you mentioned earlier that it was going to be growing and you were going to have up to how many booths next year? Yeah, so next, this year we have 110 booths and next year we have 250. So we had about 45 to 60 booths on a waiting list. So it's growing and if you want a booth, better get on it now, right? Yeah, yeah, of course. Is there anything else you'd like to add for our viewers? No, I just uh, hope to see everyone next year at the Yoga Expo at the Pasadena Convention Center. Great. Thanks so much, Kyle. Thank you. So it brings you to the Yoga Expo. I'm here because I'm really interested in healthy living and I like meeting people that are also interested in it. So I, I try to go to all events like this. What has your experience been like at the Yoga Expo? It's been really great. I actually did a yoga dance, which is yoga dance class earlier this morning and it was so fun. Awesome. And what are you looking forward to seeing still? Um, sound bath and some meditation for sure. <laughs> what brings you to the Yoga Expo? Actually, it was for my girlfriend. It was a, a gift for her for her birthday. So um, she does yoga a lot. I've done yoga a little bit. So I told her, like, we should do something together. And so we decided to come here. That's so awesome. What's been the best part so far? Um, the partner yoga. It was actually really, really good. Um, we've learned about, like, vulnerability, you know, uh, about each other. It, it was just, it was very intense. It was something that we really, you know, and then Rad also, the, the, the tool, you know, for the neck and the back. It was just, it's been a great experience. Oh, that's so wonderful. Thank you so much for sharing. Thank you, thank you. What's been the best part of the Yoga Expo? Um, well, just getting to see all the different businesses and trying all the different samples has been a lot of fun. And um, free stuff is good too. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? What she said. <laughs> and is there something that's stood out? Um, well, I really liked all the jewelry and that was really cool to look at and really cool. And then all the passion books, those are really nice. Passion planners. I liked all the free food. <laughs> free food. You heard it here. You want free food? Come to the Yoga Expo. <laughs> teach at um, 510. I'm teaching a class on pranayama and bandhas. Very nice. I might be taking that later. Yeah, <laughs> you should check it out. For our viewers who are unfamiliar with those terms, can you explain a little bit about that? Uh, sure. So, yeah, totally. So uh, pranayama is just a uh, controlled breath. Um, it is one of the eight limbs of yoga and it's just basically a way for you to control the energy flow in and out of the body. And then your bandhas are energy locks or valves within the body. Um, so um, you have three main ones. Um, so uh, Mula Bandha, Uddiyana Bandha and Jala Dara Bandha. And then the practice of all of them together um, is Maha Bandha. Um, so so basically in the class we'll just be exploring um, that energy and, and how to incorporate that into a modern flow class. That's it from the Yoga Expo. I'm Christina Nichols with ID8 TV and I'll see you next time. Namaste.